Buonasera. Um, so for those of you that um, followed, we are day five of our wine quarantine, right? So the wine yesterday we talked about, it's um, this vineyard called Bricco delle Viole, which is a crew vineyard located in the township of Barolo to the west side where some of the more aromatic Barolos come from due to the extreme elevation and the specific site and whatnot. Today I wanted to bring you to a different part of Italy. From the northwest, we're going to the northeast, an area that it's smacked right in between the Dolomites, the beautiful ski area, and the gorgeous Lake Garda slightly to the south. The warm air from Lake Garda travels north, the cold air from the uh, Dolomites travels south, and there it meets and creates a very unique environment to create some of the beautiful, beautiful sparkling wines of Italy. So, um, as you can see, the color has got a nice and very nice golden tinge to it. It still has a, you know, very, very youthfulness to it, um, uh, as I can see also some green highlights. But def definitely, aromatically, when you smell the wine, there is a, a little bit of a tropical fruit, almost like a pineapple, car slightly caramelized pineapple to it. But there's a yellow apple, also a little bit of a, you know, yellow pear. So definitely a fruit that is a bit more mature and also an element of uh, eastiness. So... Take a sip of the wine, beautiful sapidity, almost a touch of saltiness on the palate. Is it an element toasted almond? Definitely the yellow flowers continues on the nose, but also there's a little bit of a, an element of a slightly ripe yellow plum. So this is a wine that definitely has a beautiful freshness, great structure. Figured these type of wines, they spend 24 months on the lease. That's one of the hints I'm gonna give you. Hopefully you can guess what it is. Anyhow, thank you for joining even tonight. Maybe we'll take a break over the weekend. I'll see you back on Monday, although tomorrow I will post what wine was this. Salute in alto e cuori.